Meantime, a fear that Alec Murdoch could be trying to hide millions. So a judge is set to decide if someone should be taking control of the family's assets. Fox 46 chief legal correspondent Seema Iyer was in Chesterfield County courtrooms for today's hearing. There are so many parties trying to collect money from the once prominent lawyer, Alec Murdoch, who ruled these parts of South Carolina. But there was one party who led the charge today in court in trying to get someone else to take control of Murdoch's extravagant spending. Mallory Beach died in a boating accident in February 2019, and Alec Murdoch's son, Paul, was criminally charged for it. Until, that is, Paul was killed in June 2021. Now, Alec, since he owned the boat, is still a party to a wrongful death lawsuit, and so is his son, Buster, because Paul used Buster's ID to buy booze the night Mallory Beach was killed. In court, Beach's lawyer asked for a receiver to take control of Murdoch's assets, who Buster now controls as Alec's power of attorney. Listen to the Murdoch lawyer spar with Beach's lawyer. They're long on facts, innuendo, but they're real short on the law. This is not your average criminal. And so to suggest that it's just going to be a simple feat to go in there and be able to undo and figure out what all he's done uh, is intellectually dishonest. Coming up at 5, you are going to hear from another lawyer representing another victim from that same boating accident. Until then, I'm Seema Iyer at the Chesterfield County Courthouse in South Carolina.